Hello and welcome, man. Big shout out to the barber world. You know, this is uh, Bishop, man. We're going to call this uh, a barber building block, you know, for the education and the acknowledgement of learning your barber chair. Uh, you might have ordered some barber chairs and you didn't know that, hey, I had to put them together myself. You thought they were going to come put together already, but no, you have to do it yourself. So, this particular chair, the manufacturer, the way they had the lever and the, uh, the gas rod up under it, the pin was, was jammed in too tight. So, every time, I, I fixed this one now, but every time someone would sit down, it would recline without you pulling on the lever. See this lever, it's a it's a pin, I'm about to show you in a minute, but once you pull this lever, it it go the pin actually goes into uh, the metal that releases to be able to lean back. So if you have this problem, it's because of the gas rod that's underneath for the recline, and I'm about to show you that. So this is the problem. If you if you're having this problem, when someone sits in your chair and it's reclining on its own without you doing this, let me show you what you need to do. I wish y'all could see my love for this sister today. She's cute as a button. But look, so turn your chair on the side, okay? Let's get her here. You gonna need to get, 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 get down right here? You gotta show them this. This part here, can they see this part? This part. This pin, this pin that's going into this, hold on, come down just a little bit, right there. That pin, if it's doing it, it's because that pin is pressed. That pin is the key. If this pin is pressed and it's hitting this, it's gonna always recline. There has to be space. I, I I just done this one, but this pin was pressed up against here. So when you pull this lever that hits it, see? So when you pull that lever, it hits it to release it. But if there's no space, it's always gonna be pushing on it. So what you have to do, you have to loosen this screw here. You know, righty tighty, lefty loosey. Buy you one of these from Home Depot or something. You loosen it. That's righty tighty. You will loosen it. You loosen it, loosen it, loosen it. Make sure as you loosen it that you're loosening this pole too, because this pole has to come backwards a little bit to give this pin some space. Once you see there's some space in between this and this. Retighten this. Don't just leave this loose. You have to retighten this and make sure it's very snug. Like this right here, it's snug. It's snug on there. This will stop your problem of your barber chair reclining when you have not pressed the lever. It is this pin that's hitting up against here that's causing it not not to be sturdy. You have to create space so you will. Re Loosen this screw. It's gonna come back to about here. You make sure this pole come back some, and then you retighten it and make sure that there's space in between here. All right, show it back to me. Thank you so much for your time. I hope that this has been enlightened and that you know it helps your barber shop to grow. This is Bishop with Barber Building Block, wishing you peace, happiness, and success.